Hi, uh, here we have here Critical Thinking episode, and I'm the interpreter, giving you an interpretation of Critical Thinking. Of course, so I am. And this is called In Search of a Wife. What the hell? Like someone's desperate enough to uh, have to find a wife that they can't uh, go out, go to a bar, go to Search Mingle, eHarmony, Match.com. There's phone chat lines to call, there's all kinds of different stuff. There's many different ways you can date somebody. You could do speed dating, you could do multiple stuff. Oh, it's just doing rag up stuff. But, anywho, I don't know how, uh, 1766 or 1769? Well, it took him three years to find a wife. I'm wondering, is that like, like, why it takes them so long? Like, like seriously? Three years to find a wife. Like, yeah, some people takes the whole lifetime. Some people finds right away. I guess true love at first sight, so forth and so on. It's kind of funny though. We live in New York, and this is freaking in Connecticut. Had to get it in Connecticut. New Canon Library. So, uh, like how it says diaries and other. We look at people's diaries too, seriously? You're being a nosy bastard? Oh, it sounds like someone I know, but. I don't know. I mean, it, it's, um, it, it, it's not the same philosophy as it is now. 1769 is never the same as it is in, uh, what, 2014 people? I mean, I guess some of the principles may still apply. Why does it seem like some of the pages were cut, too? Maybe it's not supposed to be that way? Maybe that's how they made these books. I wonder when the book was published. Hmm. That'd be very interesting. I know when there was a search of, when was it actually copyrighted? Um, just very curious on that. I need to know that before I can. 1956. Wow. Somebody freaking copyrighted this 1956 from something that they discovered in 1769. Ah, oh, gee, people, that's almost 200 years later. It's actually 190. No, wait. 187 years? Yeah. 187 years? Wow. It's a long, it's a long time. So, I don't know why someone let that much time elapse before they they took, like, <coughs> entries and they decided to, you know, all of a sudden make it into, um, I guess, a book. Um, I mean, if, if the book was about, like, um, asking me, like, does DL have a girlfriend? Like, I don't know. Who knows? Girl just called me from your number. What do you mean you don't know who she is? Uh, well, you know, I was just here. What are you talking about? Seriously? She just called me for five seconds. Really? It's like, I'm not delusional here, people. I didn't imagine some girl's voice. People, some people may think I imagine it. But no, I don't imagine it. So... It's like even when he says he has a girlfriend, he has a way of like questioning you that like even what he said is questionable. Like what the hell? Or how what he said can be interpreted in like twenty different ways. Look, like, really? How how can you freaking say things? It's like either you do or you don't. Ah, uh, crap. I gotta tell you, it's crap. So proves the impossible possible. Why are you Shakespeare in this book? Seriously? I'm not asking you to be or not to be. That is the question. <coughs> Romeo and Juliet, maybe, right? I'm assuming that's part of this. This book is very interesting. Two ninety nine. And I bet he even buy a little even less than that. Zero dollars. They got it for free. What the hell? How do you get these books for free? Where do you find these books? Hope he's not trying to make suggestions to a certain someone here. 
that I should find a wife? <laughs> no? No? Am I reaching for straws? I haven't used that expression in a while either. <laughs> reaching for straws. Eh, that brings back memories. Or is he trying to say, lunch being impossible to find a girlfriend, really? Uh, if I had a girlfriend, if I had to give her the fifth degree. <laughs> say, who are you? What have you done? Uh, hmm. Hmm. Kind of funny here, too. Oh, it's interesting. It is by Frank Bradshaw, also known as Frankie Boy. Seriously? <laughs> His name is Frankie Boy. I don't know, God, I don't get that. I don't know why someone's, why would somebody name them? I don't know. Anyway, so, this has been the Critical Thinking episode, saying in search of a wife, I will find a girlfriend, and then get a wife, and then be a father, I guess. <laughs>